mob to a tri-county chase leading to two arrests. The pursuit ending with the suspects taking off one of the men caught on camera by our chopper, taking off his shoes and jumping right into a canal. And here is our first look at the suspects arrested after that chaotic scene unfolded. Deputies say it all began with a strong armed robbery, both these men facing several charges now. And Local 10 News reporter Syra Onward is joining us live from the scene in Tamarack. She has reaction from neighbors in that area. Syra. Christy, Janice, chaotic, dramatic. There are a lot of adjectives you can use to describe this scenario that went down yesterday. First, it started with an armed robbery, then a carjacking, a high speed chase. You see that guy taking off his clothes and jumping into a canal, and most of it was caught on video. Total Traffic's helicopter camera captures a man with a long gun getting into a white car that proceeds to speed down the turnpike. Broward Sheriff's deputies announcing these two suspects arrested in the armed carjacking, Edward Foster and Matthew Geimer Jr., both 22 years old. A view from Sky 10 showing the end of Wednesday afternoon's intense tri-county crime spree and chase that went from Miami-Dade to Palm Beach County, ending here in Tamarack in Broward County. Watch as deputies zero in on the white car. The driver bails out and runs into a neighborhood. He takes off his shoes and hoodie before jumping in and swimming across a canal. He's seen running between houses, looking for a spot to hide, and gets into this open garage. Inside was 71-year-old Gisela Taveras, a seamstress who sews in that garage. In Spanish, she tells Local 10 she was terrified. She says she told him to leave the garage, but he ran to her kitchen. She left the garage because she was scared. She flags down law enforcement who surround her home. She headed to a neighbor's house as deputies arrested the man who surrendered to them wearing only red underwear. Nearby neighbors watched police swarm the area. The whole street was full of police cars. They say they were worried about Tavares. She's always in her garage um, sewing. The woman that, that they broke in her garage. She keeps her garage door open. She's a seamstress. It all started in North Miami after a strong armed robbery and later the armed carjacking of that white car. The robber's getaway car, this stolen Lexus, which was towed away along with the white Tesla. Deputies also put the long gun in a crime scene van. Deputies taking two men into custody. So right now, both of those 22 year old suspects face felony charges related to armed carjacking. The state will recommend that they be held on no bond. That is very latest live in Tamarack. Syrah Onwar, Local 10 News.